God is our true parent. 16. God is the vertical true parent. Our Creator, God, stands in the position of the vertical true parent based on true love. Yet if God were the owner of vertical love only, His love would touch only a single point. Thus He would ask how He could expand His love horizontally. True parents, not God Himself, are the ones who give birth to children. True parents are a couple standing as the parents of horizontal true love. They possess horizontal love at a 90 degree angle to the vertical love of God, the true parent. You need love from the parents in both positions. One is the parent who is the creator. The other is true parents, whom God created in the position of the body, as his object partners, in pursuit of the ideal. Thus God is the parent in the position of the mind, and true parents are the parents in the position of the body. 17. God is the Vertical Father. He is the parent of vertical true love. Had Adam and Eve grown to maturity and fulfilled God's will, they would have become the horizontal parents. They would have stood in the position of the parents of horizontal true love. These two sets of parents would meet at a 90 degree angle, the crossroads of love. 18. God, the Creator, is the vertical Father. Adam and Eve, had they not fallen but reached perfection, would have become the horizontal parents. If they had become one centered on love and had given birth to children, those children would have resembled their vertical parent and horizontal parents. They would have become the embodiments of the love of these parents, who are true. These children would have represented both God and true parents. 19. God is the vertical true parent of true love. He is the vertical axis. There is only one such position, it is eternal and unchanging. God is in the position of the vertical true father of true love, the true parent. Without true love, we have nothing to do with God. In relation to the true parent of vertical true love, Adam and Eve are the horizontal parents of true love. The true parent's position is that of horizontal parents of true love. 20. From the viewpoint of love, God is the vertical father and the true parent of vertical love. He is the true parent who can endow vertical life and vertical lineage. God is the vertical father who can give us vertical true love, life and lineage. The fruit of that father is your mind, which stands in the vertical position. That mind is your vertical self. 21. God is the vertical parent, and Adam and Eve are the horizontal parents of true love. Originally, human beings should have been born as descendants of these two united sets of parents and, without falling, should have inherited their lineage. But Eve, before she was twenty years old and while she was still immature, paired with Satan. According to the principle, no matter how devout your faith, unless you have a chance to attend true parents on earth there is no way for you to go to the kingdom of heaven. Then who are the true parents, who have overcome the fall? God is the true parent of vertical true love, and the mature Adam and Eve are the parents of horizontal true love, the horizontal parents. With what can the vertical parent and the horizontal parents be bound as one? With the explosion of love that occurs at the 90 degree angle. Through this explosion, Adam and Eve become heavenly people as they give birth to children to create a family, a tribe, a people, a nation and the world.